If you love jazz music, well, you're in luck. Today I am speaking with local artists who make up a duet group filled with music, live performance, and I hear some improvisation. And joining me today is She Shed with Jenna and Carly. Hello. Hi. Good morning. Hi. Good morning. <laughs> How are you guys doing? We're great. Good. Okay. First off, I love the name, She Shed, <laughs> right? Thank you, yeah. <laughs> so have you performed in many She Sheds? Oh, well, not in a shed per se, <laughs> okay. but a garage, garage one. Yeah. yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but no, we mostly perform in local jazz venues or for private yes. events. That's awesome. Okay, so give me an overview of what your sound is like. What is this jazz duo all about? Um, for this event, uh, we, uh, we're doing a mix of kind of modal jazz mm -hmm. as well as some original stuff. So we'll be doing um, things inspired by Chick Corea's children's songs, okay. looper, live looping, mm -hmm. um, and, and interactive. So everything that you're going to see is going to be created in real time. Really? Yes. Wow. So what is live looping? I haven't heard of that. So there's a looper that's used most often for instruments, but mm -hmm. I use it for vocals. Oh. So you record a loop of uh, four bars, let's say, uh -huh. and you hit a, a button and it loops that so you can build your vocals on top of it uh -huh. and it creates a whole soundscape. Right. So although we are just two musicians, mm -hmm. we're creating a, a, a large sound that's really involved and complex. There's also going to be an element of poetry as yeah. well. Okay, that's really cool. So I have to roll back on the improv. So you're just literally just riffing. You're yes. just going with it. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's so fun. Yeah. With, with a yeah. pre-planned structure. Yeah. Right, right. <laughs> so it's, it's not, not it's free not, jazz. Yes, it's right, no. right. <laughs> it's going to be good. It's, you know, it's melodic. It is rhythmic. It is uh -huh. um, cohesive. Yes. Um, you know, practiced and, and put together, but with that free element yeah. as well. Yeah. And so people can listen to this um, um, event or attend it. Sounds from a house that's taking place this Sunday, March 24th at what time? 7 p.m. Okay, 7 p.m. Okay, so let's dive deeper into your musical background. Carly, you're a pianist, so how did you get your start? I actually I started playing piano when I was seven years old. Mm -hmm. I um, my parents got me lessons um, because I'd been playing around on the piano at my grandparents' house. Okay. And um, it was only a few years after that I became the pianist for my church. Okay. And um, trial by fire, you know that <laughs> that made me get better rather quickly. Mm -hmm. I studied with uh, several classical teachers, so uh -huh. I was classically trained until my early twenties when I came to Fort Wayne and. And I found a jazz mentor yes. and, and studied. I still study um, that. So I have started performing in public about eight, eight or nine years ago mm -hmm. outside of church. Okay. And so it's just been kind of a slow burn building mm -hmm. all of that. Yeah, that's great that you had that passion and just kept going and growing on it. Mm -hmm. So that's wonderful. So Jana, you are a singer. Mm -hmm. So tell me all about your styles that you do and how did you really get your start? Oh, it's varied, actually. Um, I got my start uh, with solos in school, you know, mm -hmm. um, school concerts. Then I started singing a lot of the national anthem, actually, okay, yes. in high school, and I went traveling to do that. Mm -hmm. And I studied musical theater in college, mm -hmm. so I have a BFA in musical theater. Moved to New York for six years nice. and did stuff there, lots mm -hmm. of stuff. Started writing my own music, mm -hmm. and uh, actually that was rock music. Oh. Some, uh, yeah, so very different um, genres. And then while I was in New York, I also got into jazz, and that's where my jazz story began. Mm -hmm. I was a bartender at a Chelsea soccer bar, and they had live jazz every Sunday. Yeah. And I got to meet some solid jazz players. Mm -hmm and decided I wanted to do a master's in jazz. So I did that uh, in the Netherlands, mm -hmm. lived in Colombia a little bit, and came back um, to Fort Wayne and uh, started working with Carly, and we've just really created something cool here. So, yeah, that's yeah. so cool. I mean, it sounds like you've been all around and about, and I love the educational piece. You all really took this craft seriously to get really trained, mentored, and educated so that you can put on your best performance. So how long have you two been performing together? Almost four, four years. years, yeah. Okay, 
Yeah, so nice. Okay, so She Shed. So this performance that's happening this upcoming weekend is the first of many to come, right? So this year you're going to do a little um, rollout of different things. So what are your expectations for the year? I think that we would like to start putting this on monthly mm -hmm. as well as bringing in different artists. Yeah. So um, I have uh, Kelby Clark coming in from Nashville in mm -hmm. May to do one of these events. And we want to carve out a space for people to be able to express themselves musically, maybe in ways that are, are less conducive to entertainment mm -hmm. as is expected, maybe in restaurants and bars and things like that. Yeah and more, more of a place to display their deeper selves musically. Yeah, yeah. it's like an artist's showcase, yes. right? Mm -hmm. um, but it's also a chance for the community to get together, our community in Fort Wayne to get together and see uh, whether they're local musicians or traveling musicians, to see this artistry in an intimate space. Yeah. Um, yeah. And for the artists to get paid fairly. Yeah. So that's yeah. really important yes. to us. That is. Okay, so if someone wants to attend or learn more, do they need to get tickets in advance? How does that work? Yes, tickets can be bought at carlyinglespiano.com. Okay. Um, there's a tab on the website, SOFA, S O F A H, Sounds mm -hmm. from a House. If you click on that, it'll take you right to the options for tickets to the different events. Mm -hmm. um, this one will be selling tickets right up until Sunday. There are only eight remaining. Oh, wow. So, wow. Yes. <laughs> you have to so get, get on tickets. that now. Yes. <laughs> and okay. we'll be, yeah, we'll be um, broadcasting, you know, the next shows so people can buy in advance yeah. once those are more solid. Yeah. Okay. Well, congratulations on this. It's so exciting to see you guys perform and just really experience this music, this deep musical experience, <laughs> yes. as you said. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, yes. thank you. And if you'd like more information about She Shed and this upcoming event, Sounds from a House, we'll have their website listed below, and we'll be right back.